idea what this is about. <laughs> she just feels like barking, I guess. So, I think I mentioned it in a uh, video, a recent video. I um, used another email address of mine and got a second subscription to Ipsy. So, let's see. So this is my usual one. Um, I did do a little different profile on the first one, or on the, the, uh, the new one. And yeah, this isn't too bad. <laughs> Perkana Links is so sweet. Yes, I'm going to mention her again. Deal with it. She did her um, unbagging of her Ipsy. With, she, she usually, um, maybe always, does it with her goddaughter, who is just adorable. It's like a little mini-me. They're so cute together. But uh, they were rubbing on this and scratching and talking about the texture. And <laughs> she actually went, you know, Ayla of R may not be able to. <laughs> Um, if I was having a bad texture day, a bad OCD day, and anyone who's OCD, you know, we can all tell you, there are some days that are better than others. Um, I can see this is like really close to being too much, but it's not. It, it doesn't bother me as much as the little, um, whatever you call this. What is this? What kind of ribbon is that? Anyways, I can't stand that kind of ribbon. So... Ipsy is, um, oh my gosh, is it $9.99? Yeah, it's $9.99, so $10 a bag. And you get like five, one, two, three, four, yeah, I, I was, I've got five in this one. And it gives you, they didn't used to, but I really love it. They now give you a card with information about the five items. I'm trying not to look at the items. Oh, um, but no, there are no prices though. These are samples. Sometimes you do get full size. I shouldn't say they're all samples. So sometimes you get full size. <clears throat> and sometimes you get deluxe samples. One thing I do like about Ipsy is you very rarely get these microscopic ones. It happens. I'm not going to say it doesn't, but it does. But it's rare. I'm like, here, here's one that's white. I'm trying to see if I can tell how much is in it. Well, I can't. I can't get the light to really let me see. But so this is the first item. And it is. If my phone, there we go. I can't read backwards. So it says answer from Luminous Collagen Eye Cream. Hydration and protection. Energizing and smoothing for all skin types. 8 milliliters. 0.28 fluid ounces. And if you're wondering why I'm looking the, very colorful the way I am and, and perhaps a bit shimmery, um, watch my boxy charm unbox. Well, actually, well, yeah, you can watch that and then watch this very small follow up um, supplement, boxy charm supplement video because I just did those. So this is a look using the boxy charm. Not a very good look. I um, It didn't turn out the way I wanted it. But oh well. Uh, so. <clears throat> <coughs> Excuse me. Forgive me, I am still getting a little bit over this. Um, allergy sinus thing. Okay, oh, this is... Oops. It's coming out. Um, so it says just, it looks white, but I have a feeling it's going to be... Oh, I've got stuff all over that hand, so... Yeah, it just is clear when you actually smear it around. Oh, I think I can actually smell something. Y'all, my sense of smell right now, oh my gosh, last night I pulled out, well, here, I can show you because my purse is right here. This thing that came in my uh, March look fantastic. It's in the EOS little egg lip balm, which normally smells absolutely wonderful. My sense of smell right now, this is actually turning my stomach. It smells so bad. Grapes. I love grapes. Ugh. I had to stop eating them yesterday because they smelled so foul. My sense of smell is just messed up right now. But okay, so first one, and wow, that really soaked in. Yep. Yeah. That's, so the first item is this uh, 
Luminous Collagen Eye Cream from a company called Answer From. Never heard of them. One of the reasons I like these boxes. This is Coal of Honor Intense Kajal. Forgive me, I have to take a swallow. It might be lovely propel water. Ooh, speaking of grape. And she is evidently under the bed and bopping against that center. She likes to push against the center um, post thing for the bed. <coughs> she shakes the whole bed when she doesn't, though. So it's a Coal of Honor Intense Kajal 01 Blackout. I'm kind of giggling because my husband just texted me. I didn't could read what it was. But I asked him a series of questions because... We've really got to get planning our, um, this is a black eyeliner. We're planning on renewing our vows in September and we've got, to, oh my gosh, that is, I mean, I barely touched my hand and look at that beautiful line. I mean, yes, it's not, you know, it's crooked and all, but still. Okay, since I wasn't able to put any on, let's just, I don't normally use eyeliner and I really can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> I have a feeling that just does not look very good. I'm just making this look go even further. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> oh, I think I may have just smeared it a bit. Or, I, I don't know what I did. Okay. Well, this is definitely <clears throat> is buttery soft. <coughs> Darn it, excuse me. Very nice. So that's two. <coughs> excuse me. This third thing is something I'm very pleased to have. Because um, I tried to get it, you know, where you can, they have that one day where you can add stuff on for $3. This is one of the things I wanted to add on, but all of the it um, cosmetic stuff was already sold out by the time I got to it. Uh, this is a Bye Bye Under Eye. Excuse me, I'm going to pause for a moment. Alrighty, we're back. Yes, okay. So, it Bye Bye Under Eye Full Coverage Anti-Aging Waterproof Concealer. That's this. I've really, really been loving the It Cosmetics, um, cream that came in Boxy Luxe. Oh my god, my skin is loving it. Skin doesn't look so great right now because I haven't been sick. So I've not been taking care of myself as well as I should have. Um, it's in uh, color 10.0 Light Fair. Which I'm taking that to mean that they are really paying attention to my thingamajiggy where I tell them skin tone and all that I have. Uh, I'm not going to test that because, you know, they're all pretty much the same. Let's see this one first. What is this? And this is Nomad Berlin Untergrund from Krenzberg. And what little sun I have seems to have disappeared. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Um, so that's that. I don't know what this is. I love this, by the way. Did you ever look at the picture earlier? Did I give you a chance to? Come on, focus, you silly thing. It's a skull with a mohawk. <laughs> I hope that really showed up. Excuse me. Oh, I can see the, the cruelty-free bunny back there. That's always a good thing. Come on. Uh, you just have to take me, take me a word for it. Take my word for it. That was the cruelty free bunny. <clears throat> Still. Okay, I'm thinking this is probably an eye shadow. That's what that looks like. Nomad. Fine. Sometimes this focuses beautifully, other times not so much. 
and I've ruined that in. <laughs> there was an N on there. I don't know if it was showing up. Was there a mirror? I just thought of that. No. But so this is the color, and uh, interestingly enough, it's almost exactly the same color as that eyeliner that came in my boxy charm. I really like it. It's kind of cool. Well, so that'll be fun to play with. I always love greens. And the last thing I got in here, if you watched my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus unboxing, I got a color, uh, uh, the Balm, Balm Jour Creamy Lip Stain. Um, it was one of the, I was able to get it as a $3 add-on. Um, it was in the color, I believe it was Namaste. And this is Konnichiwa. This is down, or the other one is downstairs. I can't grab it to show you. <laughs> the hand is used up for swatches. So that's this one. So definitely a darker. This to me, when they say neutrals, this is kind of what I picture. I do have a little bit of colored lip oil on. I did when I started this video. And when they say stain, they mean stain. I probably should not have done that because that's what I did with the Namaste. And then after I was through the video, oh, I really like this color. I, uh, I don't know if I looked in this mirror. I looked in a mirror and man, I mean, oh, for hours when I got to work later that night, I had pink, bright pink stain. <laughs> they were like, you've been drinking some like cherry Kool-Aid or something. <laughs> but I really like this color. What do y'all think? <laughs> yes, that's what I learned from my daddy. Okay, so that was bag number one. That was my regular bag. Um, my second bag, my new one, I have most of the same information. I did put that I'm um, more comfortable with skincare or whatever because um, I do want more skincare because I do love skincare. And this was a lot of makeup, but I'm more and more getting makeup in my it's regular Ipsy. But I also put that I had red hair since I do have a lot of red highlights. I need to wash my hair so it's not like how much it's going to show up. But um, <clears throat> oh, oh. Um, so I have red highlights and uh, my brain just left green eyes because sometimes my eyes can be very green which is kind of freaky I never noticed that until recently okay so what I my O was about was this this is a Firma Beauty what's she doing under there? <laughs> I hope that wonder her head that just bonked I don't know if you all heard that but it was a definite bonk I don't know what she hit um this is tapered brush, I guess is what you call it. It's a Firma 103. This is incredibly light. I should think this one. No, I don't think it is wood. Maybe it is, I don't know. But it's very pretty. And very soft. Oh, wow, it just astounds me how soft these brushes are. It just, and they're so smooth. I really probably should carry one of these in my purse for when I have those OCD moments when there's too much texture because that's what I need to do. I have to find something smooth and touch it. Oh, this is nice. I love brushes. <laughs> yes, we all do. Oh, I didn't show you all the bag itself. I you know talked about the texture thing, but that it's got lemons on it. I'm not a big fan of the color yellow. In fact, it's my least favorite color. It's orange. But this bag is cute. So this um, brush was outside the bag, and so is this. I actually got these in a um, in as one of my add-ons for my Glam Bag Plus. It's two face masks, um, broccoli plumping mask and Red Fruits Brightening Mask. I've not used them yet. So I can't give you a review, but two more of them. 
So now we get to see what's in the bag. I thought I had ordered, I thought I had put some add-ons with this, but if I did, I didn't get, I, I don't know what happened. Oh, oh, this is Tarte. Okay, nice. Um, Tarte Hydrating Primer Base. Oh, Hydrating Primer. Okay, it's called Base Tape. Oh, good lord, this thing's in a bad mood. I love, I love the packaging. I just, I really like how simple this is that it's not in anything else. Because, you know, it doesn't really need to be. And here's the little card again. Let's see the other card. Let's see if there's anything interesting. Oh, it does say about that. Da, da, da. I just, I forgot to say anything about the card. Or anything from the card for the first bag. This answer from... Luminous Collagen Eye Cream. It's K-Beauty. Here's another up-and-coming brand to have on your radar and your vanity. This cream is infused with collagen to hydrate, energize, and brighten your under-eye area. Plus, it's super gentle, so it's fab for all skin types. Using your ring finger, which I never remember to do, to have a pea-sized amount of this cream onto your under-eye under area. Let it soak in for a minute or two before applying your concealer. Oh, so interesting for the lip stain, it actually says, just for a light peachy stain, apply one coat using your finger. <coughs> and that it does build up as you layer it. Okay. Oh, and the name of this eyeshadow, uh, the name of this color. Um, I still don't see it on here anywhere. But they're calling it, I've lost it, they're calling it Icy Lime. That's what they're calling this color. That. Which still just really isn't picking up very well. Uh, maybe a little bit there it did. Okay, so that's pretty much it for that. Oh, that's nice. For the eyeliner it says, um, on you can um, line your upper and lower lashes and then take an angled eyeliner brush and smudge it out for a quick and easy smoky effect. Okay. All right, so we have, that's, that was a third item in this bag. And this is an Ico Black Magic Liquid Eyeliner and Wide, Liquid Eyeliner and Wide Lash. Um, Ico London is a real common thing to get anymore in these things. I don't remember seeing the liquid eyeliner and wide lash. I don't know what that even means. It says it is uh, waterproof, dries ASAP, won't fade, smudge, or budge. With its tapered precision tip, the look you can create, the looks you can create with it are limitless. Go thin with your flick or lay it on thick. Guess go thick with your flick is what I, that that's a slang I don't totally understand. Sorry. For killer cat eyes, begin lining along the inner corner of your eye, thickening the line as you reach the outer corner. Sharply wing your line up and out. I have not been able to do a, a, a winged line. I just I haven't. Maybe I'll try with this and see what comes up. Last thing. Oh, fun! I got a full-size palette. Um, actually, that was in the um, Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. And I'm ashamed to admit I did not realize something about that palette, but I can redeem myself a little bit here because I realize it does it on here. It wasn't until I watched somebody else's unboxing that I discovered, you know, you've got this girl, and it goes like this. And it does that on the palette the full-size palette that came in the uh, Glam Bag Plus. This is gorgeous. I can't even remember if this is in that palette. But is that not gorgeous? <sighs> Y'all, I'm not going to swatch that because if it is in the palette, I will probably put this in, no, probably if it is in the palette, I will put this in a giveaway. So I'm not going to swatch that. But oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. I will say I have loving that palette. It is just absolutely beautiful. Uh, ba -ba -bum. This Colombian makeup artist was New York 
is with NYX Face 2016 Beauty Vlogger of the Year. And her brand is all about bold color and self-expression. This creamy bright blue and silver shimmer, uh, silver shimmer shade is a great way to liven up your looks for spring. Um, okay, well that is it. I do wish they put prices, but they don't. And if they did, it would probably be for full size. So in bag number two, I got two masks, a full-size brush, so three full-size things right there, a Tarte base tape, um, double duty, oh yeah, it does say double duty beauty back there, and um, hydrating primer, <laughs> and a, not not a bad size, um, but definitely, you know, not full-size, uh, Black Ico London Black Magic Liquid Liner, and the single thing of Mood by Laura Sanchez. Greenish, silvery, gorgeous thing. And deluxe if not uh, full size. So I mean, it's pretty awesome for 10 bucks. Right here, all of this, 10 bucks. Not bad, and plus a cute bag. And then in the first one, just to remind everyone, I got the, I believe probably full size eyeliner, the answer from eye cream, the nomad eyeshadow, and there was something else wasn't there, oh no, oh yeah, the cosmetics, um, bye bye under eye, oh and I put it back in the bag, and the, um, the balm, balm jour konnichiwa, lip stain so not bad for 10 bucks did I mention that's 10 bucks um, I will try to remember to post a link below so that you can subscribe if you don't already I'm really trying to get better at that I hope I remember to do that with the boxy charm I guess I better look and find out how to with the boxy charm I don't think it's gonna be hard I'm sure they'll have something for me to use as always, like, subscribe, comment below. Do do do. I love, 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 love y'all's comments. And y'all have been so super sweet while I've been sick. I really appreciate that. It really means a lot to me. Uh, that's it. I wonder if I've got time to take a little bit of a nap before work. Because I've been up since about noon. Didn't get as much sleep today as I should have. But I finally opened stuff. I may go ahead and do my lure. That's that's come too. But I may wait till I'm not wearing the funky face. <laughs> Look. Funky face. Got a funky face. I'm sorry. I shouldn't sing at the best of times. Especially when I don't have a voice at all right now. Y'all have a good one. Bye-bye. <laughs>